I, uh, <clears throat> I'm sorry, but I, I'm not at liberty to divulge anyone's personal information. We can take the scenic route if you want, Doc, but we both know exactly what's going on here, don't we? And you should know she just tried to kill me, so I'm in no mood to be jerked around. I told you people not to go in without me. If they were going to send someone, they should have informed me first. We could have coordinated. Coordinated how? How exactly are you involved? I used to know Daria. She was a patient of mine. Your patient? You mean here at the drugstore? No, of course not. Before that, when I used to work for Tai Young Medical, big tech corporation. You know it? Enough to know I don't like where this is going. I headed a project. The cutting edge of neural science and cellular memory replacement. We dealt with people suffering from severe social disorders. We were making people better by making them better people. A company like Tai Young running experiments to make better people. What could possibly go wrong? I'll tell you what went wrong. The incident happened. Your kind lost sympathy with the world, and my kind lost funding for their projects. The whole thing was shut down, and it became very difficult to adequately follow up with patients. Patients like Daria. What happened? What the hell did you do to her? We were trying to help people. Imagine what it would mean if we succeeded. Anxiety, gone. Apathy, gone. Depression, gone. Diversity, gone. Spontaneity, gone. Individuality, gone. But you probably left that part out of your sales pitch. I... Daria is responsible for what Daria does. The only reason Tai Young forced me to get involved is because so much is at stake for them. Big brand name to protect. I've met their lawyers, men whose... Briefcases are filled with broken teeth. You must understand. I've been very patient so far. Too patient. That's about to change unless you start getting into details. What are you not telling me? Look, I haven't had anything to do with this for years. Tai Young Medical contacted me and told me it was my responsibility because Daria was my patient. They implied that if Daria's story ever came to light, I would take all the blame. So you're in this out of the goodness of your heart. What else? My job was to address people's deficiencies by integrating donor personality packages. That meant we needed lots of confident volunteers to donate time to our project. As you can imagine, people weren't exactly lining up to have a scrape inside their heads. So Tai Young had to diversify. Once again, not sure I like where this is going. Tai Young Medical cut a deal with various penitentiaries. Prisoners who took part in our programs, they got granted little perks, bigger cells, running water. The prisons, they benefited from facility upgrades. It was a win-win. You implanted the personality traits of prisoners into the mentally unstable? Smart. Let me take a wild guess. Daria's donor was Marek Svobodka, better known as the Harvester. Donor number 698843. All I saw, all I was given, was a series of test scores that showed a perfect match. Everything she was missing, he had. Nothing else mattered at the time. You don't really believe Daria should have been held accountable for what she did? Of course I do. This wasn't mind control. She didn't confuse someone else's memories for her own. It's... It's like they were reruns of a horror show inside her head. And she chose to emulate what she saw. My God. 
Next, you'll be telling me those orgs during the incident shouldn't be held accountable either. No, I don't think they should. Oh, come on. How desperately people try to blame their actions on anyone but themselves. The incident didn't force anyone to do anything. It overstimulated a few nerves. I don't think we remember it the same. Some murdered, others fled. The meek all cowered in the corners. You account for all these different responses by invoking individual inclination, which demands individual responsibility. People didn't become something they weren't. They became the most distilled versions of themselves. But you, you believe whatever helps you sleep at night. This implant you put into Daria. A standard confidence package, beta variety. We've been known to have bugs with it before, subjects who experience mild memories or echoes of the donor, etc. But nothing like this. You're saying there are others out there? People with the same chip inside them? We're talking about a global enterprise. Of course, there were multiple samples, candidates, tests. Mastery of any subject can only be attained through rigorous observation of repeatable phenomena. The fact that only Daria has reacted this way suggests it's not the technology that's at fault. You never even considered that implanting a serial killer into an innocent woman might be, you know, wrong. I didn't implant a serial killer. I got access to a sample, and I used a minuscule and specific segment of its enhanced neural code, enough to boost certain personality traits in Daria. It's only afterward that I got interested in the donor. Regardless, it should have never gotten to this point. Don't read much science fiction, do you? You think it was easy getting a hold of neural code for our kind of test therapies? That wasn't a donor card most people were willing to sign. Prisoners with no families, however. I learned what I need to. That guy understand what happened to her now. Please, be discreet. Now that it's over, there's no need for anyone else to suffer. You mean you and Tai Young Medical? In the end, people get what they deserve, Doctor. I have a feeling you won't be any different. Thank you. 